Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's magic dust has dulled, according to a royal commentator, who slammed the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's careers in Hollywood. It is nearly two years since it emerged Meghan Markle and Prince Harry had signed a deal with Netflix worth a reported $100 million, £83 million, to create content including documentaries, movies and children's programs. While it is understood the Duke and Duchess of Sussex have projects in the works, the couple is yet to deliver any content for the streaming service. It comes as Netflix faces huge losses in subscribers, leading to $200 billion, £165 billion, being wiped off its value this year so far. Now, royal commentators and watchers are questioning whether the Sussex's original career goals are still within reach. Danielle Welser, an experienced royal reporter, has claimed that Meghan and Harry's magic dust has largely dulled and cast doubt on the couple's lucrative future with the streaming service. Referencing Netflix's own recent struggles, Ms. Elza said, not only did the streaming giant's once unassailable hold on the entertainment industry come unstuck but so too did the supposedly cashed-up future of Harry and Meghan, Duke and Duchess of Sussex, start to look much less certain. The royal writer for Australian website news.com.au added, Harry and Meghan have proven totally unsuccessful at making themselves matter in the corridors of power in Washington, New York, Silicon Valley or Los Angeles. The magic dust of their royalty has largely dulled in the last two years and the novelty factor has worn off. So too has their deal-making momentum seemed to have waned with them not having announced any other venture since July 2021 last year when it was revealed Harry was busy working on a memoir. Meghan and Harry officially stepped down from their senior positions within the royal family in early 2020. They decided to relocate from the UK to the US to build new lives with their young family. Months later, the couple signed multi-million pound deals with Netflix and Spotify. The Duke and Duchess have released one podcast episode under Archul Audio on Spotify, a holiday special in December 2020. Earlier this year, it was revealed that Meghan was working on a new podcast entitled Archetypes which set out to tackle typecasting and stereotyping women. It is expected to launch this summer, but no announcements have been made since March. Meanwhile, Netflix have only ever publicly announced Harry's documentary about the sporting event for wounded armed services personnel, Heart of Invictus, and Meghan's animated children's series called Pearl. However, in May, it was announced that Netflix was axing the animated show as part of a wider cost-cutting move. For Ms. Elza, their lack of released content begged the question, what have they actually achieved? She wrote, Things might look different today if in the last 712 days the Sussexes had been churning out series after doco after one-off specials for Netflix, but as we all know, that is not the case. Since that earnings call in April, Netflix has laid off hundreds of staff and made the drastic decision to finally introduce advertising to the platform. Can the company still afford to carry big-name stars who don't deliver on their books? Just how much patience and faith will this newly humbled Netflix have for their yet-to-perform big-name hires? To some degree, the same goes for Spotify too here. With only weeks to go before autumn begins, again, the clock is ticking.